Welcome back. You're watching NewsX. Uh, I'm Udair Pratap Singh. Our big focus is security source in Iran's Sistan and Baluchistan province has said that seven people have been killed in the missile attack launched by Pakistan on a border village. Seven foreign nationals, including three women and four children, have lost their lives. Ari Dandia joins us uh, for more on this story. Ajay, uh, uh, has Iran released an official statement on the uh, strike by Pakistan? Uh, well, they are. As of now, there is no uh, statement by the Iran, but uh, yes, they have, con uh, you know, there is an input that uh, uh, about seven people, they lost their life, including four foreigners and some kids as well. That indicates that this uh, is going to escalate uh, in next, uh, you know, few days because uh, as of now, there is no statement and uh, even Iran haven't uh, reacted as uh, uh, after Pakistan have uh, carried out multiple attacks on uh, multiple locations in Iran. Uh, which uh, basically uh, resulted in casualty of seven people. So it is expected that Iran will uh, also re uh, retaliate and react after the, this, uh, you know, attack by Pakistan. And Pakistan says that uh, they have right to, uh, you know, um, uh, retaliate uh, and uh, definitely when uh, their sovereignty have been attacked by the Iran. So that is what indicates that now the, the things are, are going to be out of hand. Uh, for both the countries and uh, uh, instead of you know talks that that is going to escalate even after uh, we have seen that uh, uh, you know pakistan, uh, china have uh, advised uh, pakistan not to react and uh, uh, you know adopt a restraint but they haven't uh, done it and they have uh, carried out multiple attacks in iran that indicates that this is going to be a uh, you know war like situation in the coming day Thank you uh, very much for joining us, Ajay, with those updates. We're moving on to more breaking news coming in. Prime Minister Narendra Modi has released commemorative posted stamps on Sri Ram Janbhumi Mandir and a book of stamps issued on Bhagwan Ram around the world. Components of the design include the Ram Mandir, Chopal, Mangal Bhavan, Mang uh, Mangal Hari, Sun, Saryu River, sculptures in and around the temple as well. There are six stamps reportedly released, which include Ram Temple, Lord Ganesh, Lord Hanuman, Jatayu, Kevatraj, and Ma Shabri. A gold leaf of sun rays and a chopai lend a majestic icon to this miniature sheet. The five physical elements, that is sky, air, fire, air, and water, known as Panchabutiyas, are also reflected through various design elements and establish the perfect harmony of Panchma Bhutta's essential for all manifestations. Well, this stamp book uh, released by PM is an attempt to showcase the international appeal of Sri Ram on various societies. Reportedly, there are uh, stamps uh, in this book uh, which have been issued by more than uh, 20 countries, including the US, New Zealand, Singapore, Canada, Cambodia, as well as organizations like the United Nations. Akshit Gupta is joining us for more details on this story. Akshit, give us more details about this uh, uh, about this release by the PM? Well, yes, uh, you know, uh, uh, Prime Minister Narendra Modi has uh, released uh, commemorative stamps on uh, Ram Janmabhumi. Well, and, and also uh, the consecration of the Ram Temple and also the consecration of, of the Ram Lala. Uh, so, of course, uh, <coughs> I have the details. Uh, and there are six stamps, uh, you know, which include uh, Ram Temple, Lord Ganesh, uh, Lord Hanuman, Jatayu, uh, uh, Kevatraj, and uh, uh, and Shabri. Uh, so, of course, uh, these these uh, are are an attempt to showcase uh, it uh, also on an international level. Uh, and uh, you know, this is a 48 page book which covers uh, stamps issued by more than 20 countries uh, so of course uh, this is a this is an attempt to showcase uh, the grand inauguration also on an international level uh, and uh, of course uh, we talked about the stamps and uh, right now we are also uh, near the you know uh, main gate uh, of the uh, Ram Temple, which is going to be, of course, inaugurated on 22nd. Yes, we'll come back to that, Akshit, but let's talk a bit more about these stamps. Uh, uh, reportedly, the book has been released uh, by PM. It has, uh, 20, uh, it has uh, stamps from more than 20 countries. Is that correct? Also, these special stamps. Tell us more about them, whose pictures are on them, uh, and uh, what the idea is behind this. Well, yes, uh, you are right today. Uh, 
uh, the the stamps are actually issued by more than 20 countries uh, like uh, Canada, uh, US, New Zealand, and even Switzerland. Uh, and if we talk uh, more about the you know stamps, uh, so of course uh, gold leaf of sun rays uh, and uh, chopai uh, also uh, is uh, is uh, there on the stamps. And uh, as I said, uh, there are six stamps of uh, Lord Hanuman, uh, uh, Lord Ganesh, uh, Jatayu. Uh, and uh, and even Shabri. Uh, so of course, uh, as as I said earlier, this is an attempt to showcase uh, the grand inauguration uh, on the international level uh, ahead uh, of the 22nd January, uh, as uh, the Prime Minister Narendra Modi himself uh, releases uh, these uh, commemorative postage stamps uh, on the Ram Janmumi. And this is a uh, basically 48-page uh, book of stamps uh, issued by 20 uh, different countries. Yes, absolutely. Okay, let's talk now a bit about, uh, more about Ayodhya as rituals, of course, lead up to the Pran Pratishtha. And uh, these, of course, are continuing in Ayodhya's Ram Temple. The idol has now reached the Sanctum Sanctorum. A special puja was held in the Sanctum Sanctorum before the idol was brought inside. Okay, we're getting live uh, reactions. Okay, we... Okay, uh, well, uh, we will uh, show you those live visuals in just a second, but uh, let's tell you more about what's happening in Ayodhya. A special puja has been held in the Sanctum Sanctorum before the idol was brought inside with the help of a crane. The religious rituals for the Ayodhya Ram Temple Pran Pratishtha ceremony started on the 16th of January, remember, where we saw Prayaschit and Karmakuti Pujan taking place at the temple complex. The rituals will be continuing till the 21st of January before the final temple consecration ceremony which takes place on the 22nd of January, remember, around 12.30 p.m. Akshit Gupta continues to be with us. Akshit uh, is in Ayodhya now, if I'm not mistaken. Akshit, uh, tell us uh, more about where you are right now. What is the atmosphere? Uh, what is the sense you're getting on ground there in Ayodhya as the build-up continues to the 22nd of January? And more importantly, everyday rituals are now taking place, Akshit. What is expected today? Well, the temple town has, uh, you know, got a complete uh, makeover, a divine makeover, uh, if uh, I, uh, uh, you know, I precisely tell. And there, of course, you can see the visuals on your screen. Uh, so basically, this is the uh, uh, nearest point, uh, you know, from the front gate or, or, uh, of the Ram Temple where we can get to. Uh, because in the coming days, in the coming one or two days, uh, security will be beefed up uh, because uh, uh, many celebrities are also going to be there on 22nd January. Uh, almost 7,000 guests uh, are going to be in Ayodhya uh, on the grand inauguration day. Uh, but here, of course, you can see how the construction also, you know, is going on in full swing uh, because, uh, of course, as we know, the temples will take uh, years to complete. Uh, but the main sanctum sanctorum uh, is, of course, ready uh, where the consecration ceremony will take place. Uh, and also, uh, if, we, if we just, you know, talk about the rituals also, uh, then uh, it's the th third day of the rituals. Uh, so from 16th uh, to 22nd, the rituals will be taking place. We'll just continue to show visuals uh, uh, because uh, you can get uh, a deep sense to how the uh, Ayodhya looks, uh, you know, which was earlier uh, not uh, very developed. So, of course, uh, uh, yesterday uh, the idol of uh, Ram Lala uh, was uh, brought uh, into the Sanctum Sectorum. And now today after the Ganesh Ambigan Poojan uh, chanting of mantras, uh, uh, recitation will be done and then the idol will be installed, installed uh, on a throne. Well, we know uh, this is an idol uh, which has been sculpted by Arun Yogiraj, uh, a very renowned sculptor. Of course, he, you know, uh, he remained at one place uh, for six and uh, sculpted the feel about the new temple. Sir, aap kaan se hai? how do you feel about the new temple? Sir, how do you feel about the new temple? Sir, how do you feel about the new temple? कितनी खुशी हो रही है 22 जनवरी को होने वाले से अच्छी कोई खुशी हो सकती है किसी इंसान को है कि नहीं हिंदू होने का सबको खुशी है कोई ऐसा व्यक्ति हो जो ना खुश हो बता दो आप खुश हो कि नहीं है ना तो उसी तरह हर व्यक्ति खुश है ये खुशी का ही तो लहर है जो सबको देखने आ रहा है और लाखों करोड़ों लोग आएंगे क्यों खुशी है इसी कारण प्रभु रामचंद्र जी हमारे आ रहे हैं थैंक यू सो ऑफ कोर्स यू नो यू हर्ड आल्सो सम पीपल आउट हियर and they're all very delighted, filled with jubilant energy because the uh, inauguration of uh, the Ram Temple is going to take place on 22nd January. And it, uh, it, just to give you a perspective, it also you know, highlights, uh, reflects uh, the significance of Ram Temple uh, uh, into the you know, uh, 
collective consciousness of the people uh, to basically uh, show that uh, uh, show the nation's pride uh, and the uh, unity uh, of peoples. Of course, uh, as we inch closer uh, to 22nd January, uh, it is a dream come true for many. Yes, it certainly is a dream come true for many. Uh, now, as far as the Ram Lala idol is concerned, uh, uh, it was being taken through uh, the temple town in a procession yesterday evening. Has it now reached the temple? Has it been put in the Sanctum Sanctorum or will that happen later today after a puja, after a sthapna puja is done, Akshit? Rana, unki madad se apne patra aur sandesh ya jaruri kagaj bejana लेकिन पोस्टल स्टैम्प एक और महत्वपूर्ण भूमिका निभाते हैं पोस्टल स्टैम्प्स विचारों इतिहास और ऐतिहासिक अवसरों को अगली पीढ़ी तक पहुंचाने का एक माध्यम भी होते हैं जब आप किसी डाक टिकट को जारी करते हैं और जब कोई इसे किसी को भेजता है तो वह सिर्फ पत्र या सामान नहीं भेजता वो सहज रूप से इतिहास के किसी अंश को भी किसी दूसरे तक पहुंचा देता है ये टिकट सिर्फ कागज का टुकड़ा नहीं है ये टिकट सिर्फ कोई आर्ट वर्क नहीं है ये इतिहास की किताबों कलाकृतियों के रूपों और ऐतिहासिक स्थलों का सबसे छोटा रूप भी होते हैं हम ये भी कह सकते हैं कि एक प्रकार से बड़े बड़े ग्रंथ का बड़ी बड़ी सोच का एक मिनियेचर फॉर्म होता है आज जो ये स्मारक डाक टिकट जारी किए गए हैं उनसे हमारी युवा पीढ़ी को भी बहुत कुछ जानने सीखने को मिलेगा मैं अभी देख रहा था कि इन टिकटों में राम मंदिर का भव्य चित्र है कलात्मक अभिव्यक्ति के जरिए राम भक्ति की भावना है और मंगल भवन अमंगल हारी इस लोकप्रिय चौपाई के माध्यम से राष्ट्र के मंगल की कामना है इनमें सूर्यवंशी राम के प्रतीक सूर्य की छवि है जो देश में नए प्रकाश का संदेश भी देता है इनमें पुण्य नदी सरयू का चित्र भी है जो राम के आशीर्वाद से देश को सदैव गतिमान रहने का संकेत करते हैं मंदिर के आंतरिक वास्तु के सौंदर्य को बड़ी बारीकी से इन डाक टिकटों पर प्रिंट किया गया है मुझे बताया गया है कि एक प्रकार से पंच तत्व की हमारी जो फिलोसॉफी है इसका एक मिनियेचर रूप प्रभु राम के माध्यम से दर्शाया गया है इस काम में डाक विभाग को राम जन्मभूमि तीर्थ क्षेत्र ट्रस्ट के साथ साथ संतों का भी मार्गदर्शन मिला है मैं उन संतों को भी इस योगदान के लिए प्रणाम करता हूं साथियों भगवान श्री राम माता सीता और रामायण की बातें समय समाज जाति धर्म और क्षेत्र की सीमाओं से परे हर एक व्यक्ति से जुड़ी है सबसे मुश्किल कालखंड में भी त्याग एकता और साहस दिखाने वाली रामायण अनेक मुश्किलों में भी 
प्रेम की जीत सिखाने वाली रामायण पूरी मानवता को खुद से जोड़ती है यही कारण है कि रामायण पूरे विश्व में आकर्षण का केंद्र रही है दुनिया के विभिन्न देशों विभिन्न संस्कृतियों में रामायण को लेकर एक उत्साह रहा है आज जिन पुस्तकों का लोकार्पण हो रहा है वो इन्हीं भावनाओं का प्रतिबिंब है कि कैसे पूरे विश्व में भगवान राम माता सीता और रामायण को बहुत गौरव से देखा जाता है आज की पीढ़ी के युवाओं के लिए ये देखना बहुत रुचिकर होगा कि कैसे विभिन्न देश श्री राम पर आधारित पोस्टल स्टैंप जारी करते रहे हैं अमेरिका ऑस्ट्रेलिया कंबोडिया कनाडा चेक रिपब्लिक फिजी इंडोनेशिया श्रीलंका न्यूजीलैंड थाईलैंड गयाना सिंगापुर ऐसे कितने ही देशों ने भगवान राम के जीवन प्रसंगों पर बहुत सम्मान के साथ आत्मीयता के साथ पोस्टल स्टैंप जारी किए हैं राम किस तरह भारत से बाहर भी उतने ही महान आदर्श हैं विश्व की तमाम सभ्यताओं पर प्रभु राम का कितना गहरा प्रभाव रहा है रामायण का कितना गहरा प्रभाव रहा है और आधुनिक समय में भी अनेक राष्ट्रों ने किस तरह उनके चरित्र की सराहना की है ये एल्बम इन सब जानकारियों के साथ प्रभु श्री राम और माता जानकी की लीला कथाओं की एक संक्षिप्त सैर भी कराएगी एक तरह से महर्षि वाल्मीकि का वो आह्वान आज भी अमर है जिसमें उन्होंने कहा था यावत स्थास्यंती गिर सरित महितले तावत रामायण कथा लोकेशु प्रचरिष्यती अर्थात जब तक पृथ्वी पर पर्वत है नदियां हैं तब तक रामायण की कथा श्री राम का व्यक्तित्व लोक समूह में प्रचारित होता रहेगा एक बार फिर आप सभी को सभी देशवासियों को इन विशेष मार्ग पोस्टल स्टैम के लिए बहुत बहुत बधाई धन्यवाद राम राम So Prime Minister Narendra Modi there uh, giving a very very important message on the occasion of the release of the stamps let's go back to my colleague Akshat Gupta who's still live with us from Ayodhya Akshat a very important message being sent out by the Prime Minister about the idea behind the stamp book about the stamps and of course about the build up to the 22nd of January Of course uh, you know the PM's message comes Uh, in the run up uh, to the grand uh, uh, the mega inauguration of the ram temple and he has also reflected on the point that these stamps are not mere a piece of paper these actually show the significance of lord ram uh, not only in india but also globally on the international level and he has also reflected on the point uh, that uh, lord ram uh, you know has been significant uh, his uh, uh, the his life uh, uh, i mean his habits uh, have actually have had a great impact uh, on the lives of different people not only in india but uh, across the globe uh, so of course he has reflected upon that point and uh, it it actually comes uh, in the run up to the mega inauguration 
uh, of the Ram Temple on uh, 22nd uh, January. Uh, and uh, if we talk about the stamps, then uh, of course, you know, there are different components and it's, it's a 48 uh, page book issued by 20 different countries. Uh, PM also reflected upon that point. Uh, uh, it's issued by different countries, Canada, US, New Zealand, Switzerland, Czech Republic. Uh, and also it's an attempt to showcase uh, the significance, the grand inauguration ceremony uh, on the international level. Uh, and also the stamps, uh, you know, have uh, uh, photos, uh, of course, of uh, Lord Hanuman, Lord Ganesh, uh, even Jatayu, uh, and also the most uh, revered Chopai, uh, uh, Mangal Abhavan, uh, Mangal Hari. Uh, so, of course, uh, these uh, all are there uh, and it all uh, signifies uh, a symbol uh, of uh, you know uh, Lord Ram's uh, life and uh, his impact uh, uh, on different people. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon.